All right, guys. Well, guess what? Remember that oatmeal that I promised you that I'm going to make for you guys? And yes, I'm watching the microwave because I'm cooking old-fashioned oatmeal in the microwave. And look how fluffy that is. Boom. So it's actually two and a half ounces of uh, oatmeal, a little bit of water on top. You put it in there and the first couple of minutes, you can let it go. Okay, two and a half minutes, you don't have to watch it. And that oatmeal is for search because if you would only know what just happened here, <laughs> like a few minutes ago, you would die. He tried to make his own oatmeal and apparently he didn't know how. So, two and a half ounces of oatmeal. That is, uh, what would you say per rice? Because we're doing, we're substituting the cup of rice. Yeah. So is that? It's about half a cup of rice. Okay. So half a cup of rice. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do two of this today because I am feeling that I'm actually having a cheat meal. I'm not going to waste this blueberry. It's going to go right in there. <laughs> and look at my ingredients today, guys. I have about an ounce and a half of blueberries and uh, blackberries, blueberries. Um, uh, yeah, this is, uh, I usually do just walnuts and a little bit of raisins, but I got this glazed um, walnuts with craisins. <laughs> They're so good. And then of course we have some raspberries there. Uh, but this meal, it's gonna, I would advise you to have it in the morning because it's gonna give you energy, and especially before a workout. If you have to do your workout and you need a meal, this meal will give you energy and it'll keep you energized through your workout and it's carbs and it's protein um, and you have some sugars from the fruit in there. It's all good sugars, guys. It's not that crazy, um, but don't go crazy on the fruit. I literally put an ounce and a half of each of the fruit. So I don't, I mean, you could have strawberries as well, uh, but just make sure that you keep everything on track so you're not really going crazy with what you're putting in your oatmeal. Because of course you can load it up with all this craziness and then by the end of the day you really wasted um you know you ate all these calories for probably not a good reason if you're trying to tighten up or lose weight so we're going to do um carbs and protein in one meal and i'm gonna tell you guys you're gonna love it i'm gonna do two scoops of protein in here and yes i'm using the vpi um vanilla i, I would advise you to do vanilla flavor mm -hmm. or some sort of white uh, protein for the oatmeal it's just the texture of it keeps the oatmeal nice and uh, smooth the chocolate makes it a little bit thicker and heavier so vanilla is the go-to for me um, and you just kind of mix it in there with oat protein and oatmeal that's all it is and i'm not gonna put any sweetener in here guys because the vanilla protein is already so sweet uh, that you don't have to put anything else in there. So we're gonna do the um, blackberries, blueberries, raspberries. Oh, look how pretty that is. Look at that. If only it's they could not, smell this. Oh, it smells so good, it right? It smells amazing. Yeah. It smells and, like cake. And then we're gonna sprinkle this on top, guys. Ooh. Okay. And of course, mm -hmm. you know this is good for um, blood sugar, cinnamon. Put a nice amount of cinnamon in there and that's what we're talking about um by the end of this meal you're gonna be thinking of momo that's right Ooh. smell that it's yes <laughs> it smells like christmas it smells like merry <laughs> christmas like, yeah it does smell like christmas this is still hot i just took it out of the microwave so i like to mix it in there mm -hmm. when it's still hot especially the protein so it could really kind of and then you just leave it out for just a few more minutes so it could get a little bit cooled down and hardens up not that bad look at that oh my god you know what jeffrey this is absolutely delicious Ooh. i'm telling you let me make you one of this mm -hmm. you're gonna love it so just a few minutes ago serge was trying to make a <sighs> oatmeal and he i told him mike eats his oatmeal with chicken mm -hmm. when he does eat oatmeal and he was like oh i'm gonna make one so he literally put the oatmeal in the bowl and then we threw the chicken in there and then he put <laughs> water like all the way above it and then he threw it in the microwave and he said god damn it it's too much water and then he spilled the water out i said dude that doesn't look good 
It didn't sound anyway, good. This is this is what happened with his oatmeal. Yeah, <laughs> it went in the garbage. So I'm making his oatmeal because he doesn't know how to make oatmeal. Yeah. It's so simple. You put it in the freaking microwave for a few minutes. Well, well, hopefully after he watches this video. Yeah, you know what? So exactly. And I'm not gonna teach him how to do it. He's gonna have to go to my YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> and then watch the whole video. Him yep. and Cole. Really subscribed. <laughs> oh, you're subscribed too. Awesome. If he's not subscribed, I will kill him. Mm -hmm. It's as simple um, as clicking the button down below. <laughs> That's all it is. Um, guys, we have a crazy day today. We are leaving the home here. I think I've mentioned this yesterday in my workout video for about five days. So I'm packing clothes and food and everything that you could imagine um, mm -hmm. for a five day trip or four and a half days, whatever it is. Um, and yeah, the baby needs his toys. So it's a lot to do. Well, Mike is doing his videos and it's not helping with anything. Um, so, yeah, I think you guys should send him a lot of DMs and tell him how he should help around the house because he's still learning. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, he ever tries to do it and uh, uh. it didn't kind of it didn't work out. So, mm. yeah, thank goodness for Serge and Jeff because mm -hmm. I don't know what I would do without this. Right. Um, but I got my meal done. Um, I'm going to do one more of this right after my workout because i'm gonna go get my workout in right now um it is friday we are almost a week up with the reverse diet and i think mike's advice was to do it for a week i'm gonna add more carbs next week a little bit more and then we'll decide what we're gonna do for the new year i mean we need to you know i don't know if i'm gonna jump back to do the blitz again but um i'm definitely going to do some sort of program because it just mentally keeps me on track. I really love the Blitz. Um, I had so much fun doing it with my girlfriends. We checked in every day. We got a workout in and cardio. We had a plan rather than just be all over the place, you know, baby mm -hmm. workout, if I get it in, yes, no. I kind of liked it. Um, so I'm either going to put together a plan um, or I'm just gonna follow my app plan mm -hmm. with the nutrition. I'll see, I'll see where my body's at and then we'll just decide then. but that's your meal for today let me know if you love it uh, comment below and i'll see you tomorrow